Let's talk foot strike and what you should focus on. I figured it would be fun to do this based on footage from Paul Chalimo, who is an incredible Olympic long distance runner. In this phase, most people talk about how the foot lands, most notably the foot strike pattern. People typically divide these patterns into rear foot, midfoot, and forefoot strike. In this particular case, Paul Chalimo seems to land around the midfoot. Now, just because Paul Chalimo does this here as he runs a 400 meter during a training session, does that mean you should always land on the midfoot? Not exactly. Remember that your foot strike pattern can change based on your relative pace. When running relatively long distances, plenty of elite runners adopt more of a rear foot strike. However, when running shorter distances, they may adopt more of a mid foot strike. Then when sprinting, they may adopt more of a four foot strike. The overall message of this video is to not get too fixated on sticking to one foot strike, but rather, you may adopt a particular foot strike based on the situation, such as when you're running at a certain pace or when managing pain or injury in a certain region. Next time, I'll talk about what may matter more in regards to foot strike.